how are you reading this formation, Jim Beglin? Well, it's a formation, Peter, that lends itself to good possession and control in midfield because you've got the numbers there, a higher concentration. Backing that up with enough attacking dynamism is down to managers who want to get at teams. It can be used in cautious terms too, but certainly if you want to advance a little quicker and you have that attitude, then you can be very positive about this too. So that's got things on the way. Good challenge, he just stood firm. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. Pulisic. And the assistant referee rightly gives him offside. Fair to say, I think a cautious start from both teams. Tries to switch the play. Nicely controlled. And helps available out wide. Chance! Goal! The United States! Uh, given such an open invitation, he was always going to shoot. And that's what the game is all about. Find space and finish, but we have to credit the pasta to pick him out. The United States break the deadlock. And that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on. Seems now to be all about width. Well, when you have the personnel to create in wide areas, then they need to see as much of the ball as possible. Hardly anything between the sides. And the score is 1-0. Oh, that is lovely footwork. The United States are seeing a lot of the ball and have a 1-0 lead to show for it. Looking for a decent ball in. Lovely bit of skill there. And that has been clubbed away and it's been taken straight back. That's found its target. Cross deflected over the goal line for a corner. And the defence can get it clear. Oh, he's in! Chooses to go back. A really good feat. A chance to play it in. Pulisic. This could spell danger. Plays it out to the wing.
beautifully done. Plenty waiting in the middle. Plays it back. Oh, that's nice. Played out to the right. Great leap! Really well taken goal. Two up and threatening to pull clear. What a super header, dispatched beautifully. Well, as contact goes, that was tremendous, and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net. I think when it comes to the aerial department, this fella is definitely no slouch. The United States get themselves a two-goal cushion. That second goal is such a, a polarizing effect on prospective moods. I mean, one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal, and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three. Away from immediate danger. And there is the half-time whistle. Any opinion you'd like to express on the first half? Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why dither from here when they can repeat their first-half success with a, another show of strength? The United States go in at half-time on a comfortable two-goal cushion. Already up and running for the second half. That a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Lovely feet. Played into the middle. And that's been levered clear. That is terrific skill. Tries a shot! And he's there to make a great save. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Knocks it away. Cuts it out. Forward it goes. And it's got through. It's found its way to him. It's being played forward. He wasn't very far from making something happen by himself. Lovely to see. That's great strength on the ball. And the counter is on.
Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Well, he's made sure that that won't get through. Time to deliver. Oh, nice touch. Can he shoot? Oh, he wasn't being fooled. The United States have time on their side now, as well as a two-goal lead. It is just about done. And it's played forward. It's anyone's ball. It's the shapes to shoot! Decent enough try. That's a little unfortunate. He had a lot of people worried then. Oh, now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. Well, you have to feel a little for the player being taken off here. I think he's been made the scapegoat after that, but I guess something had to be done. I suppose it did need a little change. Tries to get it forward quickly. And that's that. So they bask in their win. A genuinely professional performance and a result which is well deserved. Well, after all of that, Jim, what are you thinking?